Hi everybody, welcome back to my 100% walkthrough of Assassin's Creed Origins. On this video we are going to be doing the side, next side mission in Green Mountains. This is called Halo of the Huntress. Okay, so if you finish where I did, you'll come out near this elephant camp, which you do not want to be near yet. We'll do that another time. So you want to head to this viewpoint here, where the Halo of the Huntress is. There's a viewpoint right next to it. There's also a papyrus puzzle in here as well. It's very simple. This so place, this shrine, it prickles with divine power. So once he said that, is drawing me to her. Yeah, you find the the uh, papyrus puzzle is just over here, which is simple enough. There we go. And then run up and talk to this lady here. I have felt your presence in my vision, Eagle. Apollo spoke of you. The king cried when he killed the White Heart. For it was the huntress bewitched, pale and beautiful, with a halo of gold. Apollo bade Gaia cradle the king's sorrow, a lake of tears high above the plains. The sun god drove his fist into the mountain, took his beloved inside, and spake, None shall seek you, none but the eagle. He will soar above the five cities with the halo of the huntress in his beak. Why do you call me eagle? Yours is the sacred relic, eagle. Find it and expand your riches. Okay, so once you've spoken to her, it's time to go to find this Halo of the Huntress. Now this isn't too difficult. As it says, you've got to find the lake up in the mountain. Lake of Tears, as he calls it. So, first of all, we've got to climb out of here. You could always fast travel back out if you wanted to, or you can fast travel to where we're going to go next, which makes more sense to be honest, but I wasn't sure about that. But if you come down here you'll see there's a viewpoint right near where we're going, which is a Roman camp. So if you search it all out, you'll see that this is a small camp with a tr camp with a treasure and a captain. Shouldn't be too hard to find your way through this. No, I messed this up, and I still have made it quite easy. So to dive off and swim over to the camp. Okay, so now we're in here. There's some lions here, so be careful of those. But they're in a cage, so won't worry too much. Now I tried to sneak over to the haystack that this guy's near, but it didn't work. This guy sees me. Which solves the problem, really. There we go. It still solves the problem. He's coming running over. I thought I might have get away with it, but I didn't. He's there and he's going to throw something at me, so... There we go. So, we're going to overcharge power, kill him, and then throw his own axe at this guy. Like that. And this guy's coming over to check things out. Now he's going to climb back up. Missed. He's coming over this way to look for me. So we're gonna go over there and kill him. Nice and easily. Here we go. Ok, 
Okay, so now we've got a few to go. This guy is wandering around here. I think we can kill him with a bow. So, go into these tents and kill these people. Get the treasure that you need. That's the one treasure you need. The location's done. Another bad guy in here. Kill him as well. Okay, so run down the stairs of the shrine in this area. And you'll find a wall. Okay. So there's plenty of bits and bobs around here and you can read about the Cyrene and Apollo. She sounds strong and brave. Reminds me of Aya. Apollo fell in love with her. So once you've done all that, you can head to this place. Once you've been around it, and here's the halo. We get the item, and that is it! That is where we're going to end this video, so we end the quest. So thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and until next time, it's bye for now.